I shaved my legs. All right, right, right. Up, up to where my tattoo was. Right. So I shaved my other leg just to have to match. conformity. Right. Um. Anyways, Ozzy, first day I met him, looks at me and goes, "Oh my god!" And I was like, "What? You don't like?" Leatherface, he goes, no, you have one hairy leg and one other one. So I shaved all my entire leg and my other one. And it looked like I had knee pad or like thigh pads. <laughs> and from that day on, I never saw him. Oh so God. I had like a half of a Toto from Wizard of Oz in the shower from <laughs> shaving just to see him again and go, look, I shaved now. Are we good? <laughs> um, I saw him work out one time yeah. doing jump rope. Oh, really? That would have been interesting. And his calisthenics is jump roping for five seconds. And he goes, oh, fuck it. And he just like throws. And I mean, dude, he couldn't even get one jump. <laughs> but I'll tell you, he, he hands down is one of the nicest guys. Same with Zach. I mean, just cream of the crop professional guys and a a plus people that's awesome that's awesome now we're, we we touched on it a little bit with with the browns and and we're uh where they're at this year with now they have uh well you still have baker mayfield and you have deshaun watson so i guess a lot of people are wondering here and i'll get your thoughts as you're a cleveland fan here are you happy that they got deshaun watson or are you would you rather have baker or where are you at on that whole situation at this point, I would be happy if they even got like, oh boy, or uh, what do you call him, Mister Hero mascot. At this point, <laughs> you know, it's like every time we get rid of somebody, they excel. <laughs> right. So you think Baker's gonna go somewhere, go somewhere, and take off? Then, huh? It always happens. <laughs> I mean, look at um, Bilicek. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sure he isn't crying that he got fired from <laughs> no. the Browns. Right, right, right. Exactly. He, he probably sends him like boxes of chocolate. <laughs> thank, thank, you thank you for you. making my dreams come true. <laughs> thank you for, for letting me out of Cleveland. <laughs> I mean, I always I've always said this. Um Baltimore is the Browns. Yeah. Well they are. And they and people are like, what do you mean? I go, Art Modell took his team and started it with the Baltimore Ravens. Mm -hmm. So you got to think a team that completely started from scratch. Right. So that takes, I guess a decade, uh, <laughs> right. maybe longer, but you know, they were playing good last year. I remember when they had the most losses, they had a parade in Cleveland for the most losses. Right. Well, they, they also had that was it. They had the uh, the Bud Light had the uh, the the beer caves or cases for everybody at the different bars. When they finally got a, got a win, the beer would unlock and everybody get a free uh, Bud Light or whatever. I remember that. Yeah. Yep. That. Um, but you know, sports are a addictive thing because anything could happen. Oh yeah. In minutes. Mm -hmm. And, you know, back in the day when I was really into sports, like Bo Jackson, Barry Sanders, Herschel Walker. Mm -hmm. uh, but there was this guy. Excuse me. I was playing football, believe it or not, in junior high. Okay. And I was a right tackle. I think the coach felt sorry for me because I weighed like a buck 20. Right. Uh, and... He just put me on that, on the line. Right. And I went against this guy and he kept on huffing and puffing. And he was from Sandusky, Ohio. Okay. I have never been hit so hard that I saw another time zone. <laughs> and it was Orlando Pace. Oh my, oh my, are you serious? Oh, no wonder. <laughs> That's a big boy right there. <laughs> yeah. It's like. Me saying I got knocked out by Orlando Pace is like saying that drunk guy got punched by Mike Tyson. <laughs> right, exactly. <laughs> like, like, holy crap. That, that, well, that, that's that's one thing you can say, hey, you know, you, you were good enough to play against Orlando Pace. You know, you, you could always put that, you know, a notch in your boot. <laughs> yeah, so I said, 
to myself after that hit, I, I think I'm going to play snare drum in a marching band. <laughs> there you go. You're like waiting away flag. I'm done. I'm going to play drums. Yeah. Here we go. I'm 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 playing snare drum. Well, I, I think it's worked worked out pretty well for you. You've been a pretty, pretty I, successful I think it drummer. drummer. <laughs> so yeah, yeah. Now, I, now we said earlier in this, you, you and me both were were uh, Chicago Bulls Bulls fans, and biggest reason I was a, was was a Bulls fan. I, I'm not now, but was was Michael Jeffrey Jordan. I think the greatest basketball player ever. You can have your Kobe. Thank you, you for Rock. saying that yeah, because yeah, people yeah. like to argue and they're like, no, Kobe uh, Bryant or LeBron no, James. I'm like six. He never lost. He got six. It's over. I don't, I don't care what anybody says. He Nobody like Michael Jordan made dunking and art. Right. Mm -hmm. Made a shoe that took oh. the world by storm. It, it totally revolutionized the, the shoe industry. The, the Air Jordans. I mean, everybody... With the head shoes there, but this was the Air Jordan. I mean, like the thing is, Chad. People, these kids these days, they go back and and they're bringing back back the old shoes from the eighties and nineties that we used to wear. Yeah, because their shoes look like toaster ovens, <laughs> right? Like, With like unicorn puke on it. <laughs> exactly. It's that like if you ever robbed a house, I would just know by your shoes. <laughs> but that's how that's how cool those shoes were. They're still. They're still cool 30 years later. I'm like, I know. The funny thing, I always see some of these young boys wearing these shoes. I'm like, yeah, you know, I, I had the original pair of those, right? They're like, oh, you should have kept them. I'm like, well, <laughs> if I would have known that then, hell yeah, I would have kept them. They've been worth some money, but we didn't know 